Exacto is a self-administered screening test for HIV infection, the virus that causes AIDS. This test detects the presence of antibodies that fight HIV 1 and 2, three months after the last potential exposure. It is 99.9% .9 accurate. The results can be read after 10 minutes. Before taking this test, make sure you are in a quiet and well-lit area. Read the instructions carefully. Remove the contents from the box and place them on a clean, flat surface. Check that all the components have been included in the kit. You should have one pouch containing the cassette, one bottle of deodorant, one alcohol wipe, one plaster, one pad, one blood drop collector and one lancet. Open the pouch and take out the cassette. This must be used within one hour after opening. Take the wipe and the belt out of the packaging. Remove the cap from the lancet. Disinfect the fingertip with the alcohol wipe and dry off any traces of alcohol with the pad. Place the lancet on the fingertip and activate it by pressing firmly on the other end. Squeeze the fingertip until you form a large drop of blood. Position the blood drop collector vertically and place the white end onto the top of blood to fill it completely. Place a drop of blood into the square well. Make sure the bottom of the square well is completely red. Place two drops of diluent into the round well. Wait 10 minutes before reading the results. Be careful not to wait longer than 20 minutes. While await, apply the plaster provided to the punctured area. 10 minutes have passed. You can now compare the result of your test with the images provided in the instruction manual. If a bound appears by the letter C and do not by the letter T, the test is negative. If a band appears by the letter C and by the letter T, the test is likely to be positive. If no band appears by the letter C, the test is invalid. A new test must be taken. Caution! A negative result does not exclude the possibility of an infection in case of risk of exposure dating from less than three months ago. Caution! A positive result must be confirmed by a laboratory test. Please consult your doctor.